man. He's a man. All right, and so I see you're wearing the Lakers shirt. You got the Dodgers shirt. You're wearing the Canelo band. Why is Canelo such a staple here in Los Angeles? Why do you think he represents the people here? You know what? It's just the hard work. Um, he's just a, he's just a man of the people. We support him for that. We got Victor here, so we're going to get Victor's analysis on this. Victor, it's going to be a tough fight for Canelo against Triple G. How do you see this playing out? I think they're both uh, professionals and consummate uh, boxers of the sweet science. I think it's going to go the distance, and whoever makes a mistake, that's who's going to get caught. So he sees it going the distance, guys. We're going to be talking to some more fans while we're out here. Um, but I think I'm going to start hanging out with these guys. They look like a real fun bunch. We'll throw it back to you. Man, Jessica, hopefully those guys got a mover. As they got here to Maple Center at 6 in the morning, I don't even want to know how much play paper market. It's worth it. Seeing different types of, of mitt work, pad work with Canelo. We saw the pool noodles, which is more defensive. We saw the pillow, which is more about. We saw the pillow, which is more about power and accuracy. And now we're seeing the hand mitts. Which is more about combinations and speed and fluid fluidity. And I think Canelo has that. And I think one of his edges going into this matchup, at least physically speaking, is his quickness, his hand speed. Wearing the green, white, and red Everlast with his CA logo. Canelo Alvarez. How old is he, Doug? 26 years old. I just want to hear you say that because he's still a pup. Yes, he is. Now, he's, he, he, experience, yeah, he's a pup. He's just now entering his athletic prime and physical peak. Gennady Golovkin, 2004 so, silver medalist. He's how old? He's 35, but ages in boxing are a funny thing. Not all 30 year olds or 35 year olds are the same. For instance, Miguel Cotto is going to go into the Hall of Fame. He's 36 years old. He's only one Cotto's year. 36? He's 36. We saw him Saturday. Yes. Yeah, he's just one year older than Golovkin, but he's been a pro since late 2000. Gennady Golovkin didn't turn pro. We saw the pillow, which is more about power and accuracy. And now we're seeing the hand mitts, which is more about combinations and speed and fluid fluidity. And I think Canelo has that. And I think one of his edges going into this matchup, at least physically speaking, is his quickness, his hand speed. Wearing the green, white, and red Everlast with his CA logo, Canelo Alvarez. How old is he, Doug? 26 years old. I just want to hear you say that because he's still a pup. Yes, he is. Now, he's he's experience, yeah, but he's a pup. He's just now entering his athletic prime and physical peak. Gennady Golovkin, 2004 so silver time. medalist. He's how old? He's 35, but ages in boxing are a funny thing. Not all 30-year-olds or 35-year-olds are the same. For instance, Miguel Cotto is going to go into the Hall of Fame. He's 36 years old. He's only one Cotto's year. Cotto's 36? He's 36. We saw him Saturday. Yes. Yeah, he's just one year older than Golovkin, but he's been a pro since late 2000. Gennady Golovkin didn't turn pro.